Welcome to Lifestyles of the Strange and Exotic it's Dark and Dreary Hall. I've got my four main lights, which still aren't enough, and I'm still not sure if I'm like, <laughs> Hi, how are you? Now, today I went back to the whale since I had to return my fire welder footy pajamas because for some weird reason, whoever fits in those footy pajamas must have legs thinner than my arm because it would fit in like the bulgy parts, but not my legs. <laughs> but I'm, so I'm like at 450, it going back. So I you know, did other th odds and ends today. And the first thing my friend and I went out to, she's like, oh, well, we're going to go shopping to uh, Joanne's. And I'm like, okay. <laughs> Ow. Ow. <laughs> and <laughs> I'm looking, it's like, everything's on sale, but I couldn't find anything I liked. And then I found a few things, and since my by the time you see this, my birthday is long since passed, but as I am filming this, at the end of May, my birthday will be coming up. So she's like, okay. And I saw this, like, strand of beads that had, you know, Egyptian symbols. There was a scarab, and I'm pretty sure it was a wadget eye, and maybe, like, the pharaoh's mask. And it was just there, and I'm like, shunk, woo! And she's like, okay. <laughs> and I'm like, well, that was quite the idea. I was gonna... So I found one thing that she still ended up getting, but it was my, sort of my payment as tech tech supervisor there. <laughs> so thank you, Jean! Even though I had full intentions of buying this myself, I'm trying to get the stupid coupon to come up, and for some weird reason it wouldn't come up in this particular one, which is sort of awkwardly placed, even though it's kind of closer. But I discovered this! Now I just put the chain on myself because most of the chains I'm allergic to, and these are stainless steel and have been on other things. And this is an actual agate. And there were a couple of them there. One had just the this part, but like this was like a little triangle here, which looked kind of cool. Like, eh. One was just sort of meh. But this one was one that's like, you must take me home! Because I love the sort of quartz part here. Now, to me it looks very much like quartz, so I'm not sure if there's quartz and agate or not. And then of course you have the striping, and this is what the actual stones look like. So this would probably be a banded agate. And there's different versions of agate. There's like a moss agate, which actually looks like there's moss inside the stone. I have a couple of them. So this was just so flippin' cool. And I wasn't aware you can use more than one coupon at a time. <laughs> I'm like, thanks, Jean. I'm going to keep that on, you know, because it's usually, okay, 40% off, and there's like 60% off for your entire thing. So she's like, so you know, saved quite a bit of money. So this was not on sale, but she used a coupon. <laughs> So I'm not quite sure what you paid for. It was like $7.99 regular price. So whatever. Pretty sure it wasn't half half off, but she used the cute. I don't know, but she saved money. But I got to keep it today. So it's very happy. And it's quite hefty, too. So I like my like pretty agate. <laughs> so, uh, I kind of want the chain to be a little longer, but that's the longest one I got, I think, at the moment. So after coming back from that, and she had to head off early, so it gave me plenty of time. I ended up going to the will, as I said, to bring back my footy pajamas. And of course they give you store credit, so you can't like get your money and it's like, <laughs> yeah, I'm pretty sure I'm going to be able to find something here if not I've been here like twice already this week. And I did. So what I got went over by like 28 cents. And I'm kind of looking, and this is my pendant thing there. It goes, pendant wire wrapped agate black. What do do? <clears throat> so, I'm kind of looking around, and I kind of wished <laughs> that, well, I ended up getting it anyways, but, focus. So I'm looking around, kind of like, okay, what's kind of cool, even though I've just been here the day before. But I did find <gasps> this, which can go in, she's got quite a few friends now, so I think I'll have like a fairy, <laughs> a place for fairies. And this was two dollars. And I just thought she was kind of cute. Not so sure what I feel about the painted toenails. Well, I guess she's okay. She, she, she's a high fashion fairy. <laughs> Though the wings are kind of wonky because you got long wing here and a short wing there. I don't know, but she's styling. Kind of like her attitude. Very pretty face, actually. Hope you're picking that up. So, I thought those were really kind of adorable. Thought the flower was pretty. Kind of looks like my African violets that are still alive. So, 
That's my my fashion fairy. <laughs> and I grabbed the last one of my mugs there. I got all the blue ones, and this one was still sitting there at a dollar bill. And I love these mugs because, like I said, they had a nice big handle. So I have all four of the blue ones, and now I've got this one. What do you, what do you call this? Terracotta? So, yep. And they're microwavable and dishwashable, so that's why I'm like... Oh. Wow. Came from Pottery pottery Barn Sausalito. <laughs> oh. God, what the hell would this be in Pottery Barn? Not cheap. And I got it for a buck. Probably at least five bucks. Oh yeah, we were in... <laughs> and yeah, I was wearing my, my Star Wars t-shirt because I pulled it out for the fourth. And just the irony, I see this mug and it's a stormtrooper head but it was like in the clearance section there but it didn't have a price on it and i'm like okay well if it's cheap enough i'm gonna get a stormtrooper go and ring it up 15 bucks for a mug what the fuck it's like yeah disney you got enough monies dude even if it was a darth vader head it's like 15 damn mug dollars for a mug god only knows how old that candy was in there but yeah i got a pissed Needless like, I did not buy it. No would have ever asked me to. <laughs> and the last thing I got. These just made me smile because I actually have now a couple of the pans that Grandma had that, you know, 90% of my meals have come from. <laughs> so it's like, anybody my age, probably even still, <laughs> knows these pots. And they're legit, just tiny versions of the little pots. <laughs> so these made me happy. And they're measuring cups. It's so freaking cute. So it just made me happy. And I think I might just hang them up somewhere. Cause, and, and then there's one that's a little bitty frying pan. But this one, this one doesn't actually have the measurements on it. So it must have gone to the collection. But there's no... So I've got the two little, little pans. And they're each a cup. And these are 50 cents a piece. Oh yeah, because I saw saw the little saucepan here, and I'm like, if only it had its little cover though, that would have been cuter. But this this just made me smile in a little bitty frying pan, and it's it's exactly like the little front, you know, the actual sized frying pan. So I'm wondering, with the little bitty frying pan, if I could cook an egg in this. I don't know, being the size, if the heat distribution would be too much. I do not know. They just remind me of Grandma, even though she's a lunatic and I had to deal with her. <laughs> so, yes, these made me very happy. So I, I don't know. I mean, this doesn't have the measurement. What other pans are though? They had they usually have like your large sauce pans, and you have like your medium sauce pan, and then you have your frying pan. I thought there was another type of pan. I don't know. So I don't know if it was just the cup. And then you've got the marks for three-fourths, two-thirds. Huh. Yep, two-thirds, one-third. Still trying to figure out what three-fourths is. I don't know. But they were cute, made me happy. So I, I feel I have a better bargain now with the little bits and bobbles than my footy pajamas that didn't fit. They, and those came from Kmart. So maybe that's why most of them I've never had a problem with. And it's like, it fits over my butt, fits over my gut, yet somehow not my thighs. What shape do you think these people are? I do not know. So, my fashion fairy and my pots and pans are going to go and do whatever it is we're going to do today. <laughs> okay. My brain's like, Really? I think we need a nappy. I do. Alrighty. <laughs> Thank you for watching. Do remember to comment, rate, share, and subscribe. There's always room for one more at the Strange and Exotic. See you next time. Bye. Yeah, these are, these are just right for you. Yep, these are different size pans. Too bad you can't have thumbs. You can cook me nummies. <laughs>